the project was to show the relationship between solids and planes. I wanted to prove that it is a fluid relation that depends on variable factors. The first action I took was to quickly rotate a piece of paper that is conventionally treated as a kind of plane. The experiment showed the formation of a revolving solid, drawing my attention to how planes gain three-dimensionality. I took the next step in virtual space, examining its properties. I wanted to reverse the first experiment, creating a 3D object and using the possibilities of the digital world, strip it completely 0.000 of its width. I observed that the lumpiness of the object, due to the emergence of an unusual phenomenon, two-dimensional texture that reacts to light on an ongoing basis was still noticeable. Then I filmed the stationary plane circling it around the circumference of the circle, which again resulted in the illusion of its lumpiness. This drew my attention to the role of the viewer, the subject shaping the subjective relationship between the solid and the plane in the object through his behavior. In the next step, I started to investigate how context influences the way we perceive the world. By turning around, I created a perspective that allowed me, given the appropriate shutter speed, to show the plane of what might seem like three-dimensional surroundings. The next experiments allowed me to see how space-time is dependent on motion, which is always determined and measured in relation to frames of reference. In further action, I wanted to show the previously discussed issues on a larger scale, trying to think more broadly, more fundamentally. In this way, I understood the primordial nature of the subject in the context of heaven and earth, the greatest human, simultaneously and potentially, planes and solids. Moreover, I saw how conventional and fluid a plane is in relation to the plane, not looking at it just as a potential solid, and how a solid is conventional in relation to a solid. The whole process is thus a demonstration of the variability of matter through the relations of planes and solids in the context of rotation.